Yeah, roll over her one, so she sounds just like a Packer. But isn't that interesting? Yeah. Uh, I tell you, well, I haven't seen the aircraft. This is the first time I've seen it in uh, several weeks. Uh, so, well done, you guys. But yours, of course, uh, although we now refer to ours as Thumper, yours, not only Vera, but also the Minarski uh, Lancaster. We call her the Minarski Memorial Lancaster in honor of a Canadian Victoria Cross winner. And uh, it's to his memory, and of course, all of those Canadians who made sacrifices in Bomber Command, uh, we decided to dedicate our aircraft uh, in their memory. Yes, but it truly was a Commonwealth effort, of course, and we uh, must uh, remember in addition to uh, the lives given by the British, but also there are in excess of 50,000 Canadians flying uh, with the Royal Air Force in the Second World War as well. Certainly, uh, Canadians made up uh, uh, many, uh, much of the strength of the RAF units throughout the war. In fact, uh, 100 Canadians flew in the Battle of Britain. An impressive total of 7,377 Lancasters were built between 1941 and early 1946. Of these, some 3,500 were lost on operations and another 200 or so destroyed or written off in crashes. Many of the Lancasters did not survive the war, were simply scrapped, and when their service is no longer required, of course, the uh, aircraft went into various, uh, oh dear, ghost scrapyards, and used for spare parts and everything else, and here we now see...